What's one thing almost every family in this country can agree on? Healthcare costs too much. The main reason why we have waste in healthcare financing and delivery? A lack of competition. This is Washington Waste Wednesday. Drugs cost too much, hospitals cost too much, doctors cost too much, MRIs cost too much. Healthcare costs too much. That's largely because of regulatory overkill from Washington, D.C. that imposed transactional costs on doctors and other medical professionals, including compliance and reporting requirements that add to administrative cost. This all adds to the cost of care delivery. Now, you would think that your federal government would do something about it. But let's remember, under Barack Obama, when he ran in, what, 2008, he promised, oh gosh, if Obamacare was passed, every family is gonna save $2,500. And nobody will lose their doctor, by the way. Did any of these two things happen? Nope, you lost your doctor, and healthcare costs skyrocketed. In the first year of Obamacare, 2014, 4.7 million Americans lost the plan they had at the time. Today, in 77% of U.S. counties, Americans only have one or two insurance choices. And networks have narrowed in the remaining plans. This means it's harder to access a physician of your choice. 72% of all Obamacare plans have narrow networks. And so now what the Democrats want to do is they want to say, we're all going to be on one program so we can ruin the health care for everybody. Half of Democrats in the House and 14 senators propose outlawing private coverage and putting us all on a new government-run program they call Medicare for All. In reality, Medicare as we know it will go away in favor of this new government-run health plan where someone in Washington decides what gets covered. They will not tell you that they want to take away all your employer-sponsored insurance. The biggest number of people in the country, by a long margin, 150 million plus, we all get our insurance based on your employer. That goes away under the Democrats' Medicare for All plan. You'll lose your plan and get put on a new government-run program. Americans have real, legitimate concerns with their health care system today. Costs are too high, choices are too few. But the solution to that isn't more government. It's peeling back the government policies that created this mess in the first place.